It's a wonderful town. And the people here are, most people, are wonderful. It uh, almost re reminds me of It's a Wonderful Life. That's the kind of town it is. It's, they, they care for you. That's the world Jerry Wagner sees from her small antique store in Jeffersonville. It is a world that was shattered five years ago this month when this wonderful town learned something that was not wonderful at all. I was just shocked. Things like that don't happen in Jeffersonville. I, I know that's what people always say, but that's true. An eight-year-old girl was killed in a house fire, and beyond that, the fire was set. And beyond that, everyone knew and loved Mackenzie Branham. Mackenzie, wonderful little girl. And so the whole town was just absolutely in shock. And still not over it. All these years later, there's still no arrest. The Ohio State Fire Marshal's Office says it is an open investigation and isn't commenting on it. An empty lot grows high grass where the house once stood. You see the house and it brings it all back. All back to a little antique shop in a little town where someone somewhere has a big secret. Who set fire to a home where a little girl died?